hi everyone in today's video i will take up a ship stability question which is related to load line marks and the reason i take up this question it often confuses students so let's take this question here uh, there's a ship which is uh, 120 meters in length and it has a summer draft of 8.64 meters and a tpc of 14 tons the loaded displacement of the vessel is 8960 ton state the ship's draft if loaded to tropical waters in fresh water all right so here you are ship's length is given to you the summer draft is given to you and tpc is given to you you also have the loaded displacement you have to find the ship's draft if loaded to tropical waters in fresh water so remember this is the situation here so let me show you this is where the ship has been loaded until the summer draft and the summer draft that is the summer draft is 8.64 meters that is means that from the water level to the ship keel from the water level to the ship keel it's 8.64 meters all right that is the current scenario the displacement is 8960 tons and now the ship is going to be loaded in tropical waters up to in fresh water so up to tropical load line if loaded to tropical load line not waters but tropical load line sorry tropical load line in fresh water so that means the ship has to be loaded until here the tropical fresh water load line all right so tropical fresh water load line so it will be loaded to tropical load line in fresh water so that means that we have to sink the vessel by a total of this distance from summer load line to tropical freshwater load line all right so instead of finding the whole distance at one go we divide it into two distances so remember from tropical to tropical fresh is freshwater allowance just like from summer to fresh water is fresh water allowance as well but from tropical to tropical fresh water is also called fresh water allowance now remember the distance is up to the upper part of the load line mark the upper part of the load line mark i haven't drawn it in a way that confuses you so normally the, there is a lower part of the load line mark and there's an upper part of the load line mark now all those distances refer to the upper part of the load line mark all right i didn't want to confuse you so that's how i have drawn it and then the distance from summer to tropical is 148th of the summer draft so if i can find out the distance from summer to tropical and then i can find out from tropical to tropical fresh i can just add these two distances together to find how much the vessel is going to sink by because if i can find out the sinkage i can add it to the currently known summer draft to find out the tropical fresh draft all right so let's find out the fresh water allowance first so what is the fresh water allowance formula it's displacement so this triangle stands for displacement of the vessel which is given to you as 8960 tons 4 is a constant and tpc is given to you as well which is 14 remember if you use 4 the answer that you will get is in millimeter if you use 40 the answer that will you get will be in centimeters so 8960 divided by 4 times 14 gives you 160 millimeter but remember the drafts are all in meters so this unit should also be in meter now 1000 millimeter equals 1 meter therefore 160 millimeter will be equal to 160 divided by 1000 which is equal to 0 0.160 meters that is the fresh water allowance that means you have found out this distance here as 0.16 meters or 0.160 meters now if i can find out 148 of the summer draft so summer draft is given to me as 8.64 meters that's what is given to me in the question itself summer draft is given to me so 148 of the summer draft means 8.64 divided by 48 you will get 0.18 meters now because this draft is in meters your answer will also be in meters so that means total sinkage that means this distance here this distance here is nothing but 1 by 48 of the summer draft plus freshwater allowance so this is freshwater allowance and this is 
1 by 48 of the summer draft right when I add them together it's 0.34 meter that is the total sinkage so the summer draft which was given to us was 8.64 meters we sunk the vessel by 0.34 taking it from the summer load line to the tropical fresh load line so therefore the draft or tropical fresh water draft will be 8.64 plus 0.34 which is equal to 8.98 meters so once again the vessel was loaded up to summer load line we had to sink the vessel up to tropical load line in fresh water the upper upper part of the tropical freshwater load line this distance is called the sinkage in this case and we divide it into two distances one by 48th of summer draft which is the distance from summer load line to tropical load line and then from tropical to tropical fresh is freshwater allowance use the formula for freshwater allowance to find the freshwater allowance in meters and then 1 48th of summer draft you can just divide the summer draft by 48 and you will get 0.18 meters and then add the sinkage to the available summer draft to find the tropical freshwater draft so it's important here that you draw the load line marks to get a comprehensive understanding of whether your vessel has to be sunk or risen also you have to note that this distance of 120 meters of ship's length was irrelevant in this question it was just given to confuse the student you don't have to load it use it here all right so thank you for watching today's video i hope you learned something from it let me know if you have any questions or concerns or queries i'll be happy to answer it uh, please share subscribe and thank you for supporting the channel bye